We're here to help you understand how to use some of the unique features of your event app so you can make the most of your experience. Let's get started by learning how to connect with friends. First, go directly to the settings icon and enter your information. This is done by tapping the gear icon towards the top of the dashboard and selecting My Profile. Once the profile screen is visible, you may enter your information manually or import it from your address book or LinkedIn. To use either the address book or LinkedIn function, click on the download tab located in the top right corner. If selecting LinkedIn, you'll be prompted to enter your LinkedIn login information. Once you've successfully logged in, the app will refresh and your profile will be imported and displayed in front of you. If you want to use your address book, select the address book link and scroll to find yourself in your address book. Then select yourself and the app will automatically add you. To add your picture to your profile, tap on the picture sign next to your profile. You may choose to use a picture from your photo library or use your device's camera to take a picture. You may then enter the rest of your selections manually. Don't forget to scroll down and select Publish My Profile and then hit Save. By doing this, your information will be visible to other attendees and allow them to connect with you from within the app. Don't worry, you can publish your profile and still control who you connect with inside the app with some other settings we will show you later. Or you may remain private by not publishing your profile as well. If available, scroll down below your profile information to add more detail about your profile for better event information. After you have saved your profile, hit the home icon in the upper left corner of the screen to return to the dashboard. To connect with friends, simply tap on the attendees icon. Please note, on your app, it may be labeled another name, such as friends, app users, networking, or some other identifier. You can search for friends by name using the search bar at the top, or you can scroll through the published friends list. Select a contact you wish to connect with and tap request friend. They'll receive a notice that you are requesting their connection. All of the friends you've connected with are stored in the message center. There are two ways to get to the message center. The first is to use the menu option located in the top left corner of the dashboard. This adornment will turn red whenever there's an update in your message center. Another quick way to get to your message center is to swipe right from your dashboard. Once your request is accepted, you can chat, take notes, schedule a one-on-one -on -one meeting, and add their contact information to your device. You can also share your schedule with them by checking the share schedule box at the bottom. You can also keep up with your friends by viewing their activity feed located in both the message center for friends and the attendee list tab for each friend you're connected with. There's plenty to do in the app and the information is updated regularly, so be sure to refresh to ensure you're utilizing the latest updates. Tap on the other icons and see what tools become useful for you. And remember, for help, you can always contact us at support at core-apps.com. Thanks for your time and we hope you have a great experience at your event.